What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. It's a free general collective reading for all signs, Captain Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 05. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to do donate. I received a channeling. I wasn't going to do any more, but I received a channeling, so we'll go ahead and do it real quick. I have to leave in about an hour, like an hour and a half. Um, I don't want to be late, so. Um, but we got plenty of time to do it, so I'll do it. Um, I've got that those classes I have to take for the city divert. <coughs> excuse me, the city diversion program. Um. <clears throat> for that disturbing the peace charge uh um in october 2021 so it'll be removed off my record and all that so well not expunge but it will be um it won't be on there and then i'll have to expunge spend spend like the two or three thousand dollars to expunge it um so um you know is what it is but okay so yeah so anyways so i received a challenge so Hope everybody's doing well. I do. If you like to, um, oh yeah, that's it. Okay. So the channel message I received was someone that did black magic on you. I heard for years. They did black magic on you for years. I heard, but you did not do any black magic back to them at all. I heard specifically at all. It has already started backfiring and it's going to start backfiring in huge negative ways. I heard many people. Many people did this on you. So whoever you are, you're a powerful being. And I mean, so much so that many people felt the need to do black magic on you, which is sad. I mean, you can feel threatened or jealous or envious or what have you, what have you, of somebody, but you should never um, utilize uh, dark arts on them. And that's just the truth. But however that resonates, it was not just one person. It was many people that did this to you. But... Black magic always boomerangs back energetically, either a little bit or a lot. In this case, it's about, it's a lot, it sounds like. I heard it's already started backfiring on these people. It's about to start backfiring in huge negative ways on these people. So, black magic backfiring can backfire in many ways. Severe motor vehicle accidents, physical health declining, mental health declining, um, <clears throat> huge unexpected money losses in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, uh, Unex like a series of misfortune events kind of like um um i think of that movie um final destination you know where they're um driving and then the well, behind the logging truck and then the log mysteriously fall falls off and boom right into the windshield of the vehicle and kills the person um kind of like that um See, I'm not saying that's going to happen, but I mean, something similar to that, like something so bizarre and strange and horrific that kind of like that, or in, um, the same movie, um, where the woman gets into the shower and the cord gets wrapped around her. She gets, um, strangled by it. Something, you know, something crazy and like off the wall and, but horrible. Um, that could be black magic backfiring, but it really could be anything is what I'm saying. But I heard you never, never, never did black magic to them in the past. You never did. You never did. But they did it for you, to you for years, years. But it's already backfired. It's going to continue to backfire. Maybe we'll, oh, maybe we'll hear how it does it. Um, Wake up call. Everything happens in a reading happens for a reason. Wake up call. They're about, I think some have already gotten a wake up call. Some were about to. I heard it was a bunch of freaking people that did this to you. So you're a strong, energetic, powerful being. Um, and we're not talking about money here. We're talking about energy. You are a strong, energetic, powerful soul and being, ma'am or sir. Your energy is pure. It's, it's good. They, I feel for some, they were energy sucking off you in the past, too. Um, but they're, they've already gotten a wake-up call or they're about to. Heavy dark arts in here.
spare my stitches here, have a bucket. Spare my stitches here, have a bucket. Unfoldment. Synergy reverse. There's no synergy here. Synergy is basically um, copacetic energy that makes things flow in a positive way, kind of like the cogs in a wheel or the gears in a clock or um, everybody working in a teamwork fashion to get a, a project done or something done in some shape, form, or fashion. No synergy here um, because they're about to get bad karma um, because of their karma base feel, basically. And um, it's time to pay the piper in the dark arts realm basically um and i heard you never did it back to them and they did it to you for years well it is time for them it sounds like it's overdue time for them to get their karma um and that's just the truth it is definitely over time overdue time and it's about to it's already happening and it's about to happen there is a particular community unusual amounts of cancer in this community because of Viewing in on a family in the past in a legal voyeur camera. That's one way this is backfiring. Oh my God, this is terrible. So you plug it in how it resonates. So the black magic wielders, there was some kind of, okay, so some kind of illegal voyeur camera energy in the past of a family. Now, it's past energy. It's not going on now, but this could be you they were illegally voyeuring through an illegal voyeur camera of the past or somebody else you know or you're about to hear of or what have you what have you but a family was illegally voyeured in the past however that resonates there's an unusual rate high rate of cancer i heard in this community that basically illegally voyeured this family in the past it sounds like the people that voyeured the people uh the family through the past in the illegal voyeur camera Sounds like they are developing cancer, unusual rates, high rates of cancer of people. I think the voyeurs in the camera in the past, I think the free radicals were boomeranging back on them, um, is what I think. I didn't hear that. I think the free radicals are boomeranging back on them and it caused cancer in them. I feel for some, they could have had low immune systems already and then the free radicals boomerang back probably caused the cancer possibly but um that could be the unfoldment too unusual amounts of um people with some kind of i didn't hear specifically what cancer it was um there's many types of cancer there's benign there's malignant and there's stage one through stage four and many types of cancer so whatever kind of cancer that is but unfoldment all these people about to realize they have cancer or they've already found out they have cancer or other people about to find out they have cancer. Series of chain of events with these people. I heard unusually high rate of people in this community with cancer. Um, that is terrible. Some already found out they have cancer. Some more are about to find out they have cancer. It is about to piss this community off in a huge way. Huge way. Position of high authorities, jobs are about to be taken for this. This was wrong on many levels. Okay, so some people already found out they have cancer. Some more about to find out they have cancer in this community. Um, and uh, this is terrible. This is really terrible. Um, and I heard positions of high authorities Posi um, positions and jobs are about to be taken for this um, because what they did was wrong. So I think positions of high authority illegally implanted this um, for your camera in a family's house in the past to make some kind of financial gain off of it. Um, and But it, in turn, they used the community to s spy or watch this family, but it sounds like a lot of these people that participated in it, whether they were spying or just watching or they were lied to and said it was something else and it wasn't, some kind of scam or spam or fraud, um, they have already, some have already developed cancer, some more are about to, and it's not just one or two people. It's a 
bunch of people. I heard an unusual high rate of cancer in this community. So that could be the unfoldment of events. I heard some have, uh, many have already found out they have cancer. Many more about to. About to be a lot of people. A lot of people. Official reporting energy already occurred. More is about to occur. These people are about to regret they ever did this. Okay. Um, official reporting energy already occurred. More is about to occur. These people are about to ever regret they did this. So, um, <clears throat> well, you, I mean, that's terrible. That, I mean, that's terrible is what that is. That's seriously terrible. And it's positions of high authorities in a community that sounds like use other community members. Uh, they abused and exploited the family, but they not only abused and exploited the family, they abused and exploited the voyeur, um, the people viewing in through this voyeur camera, which I feel a lot of these people didn't know it was a voyeur camera. But these people are getting negative karma because I feel they already had low immune systems or decreased immune systems. And I heard many people have already acquired cancer, already found out they have cancer. Some more are about to. Unfoldment um, could be the, the cancer, already found out they have cancer or about to find out they have cancer. And um, the official reporting energy that's already occurred in the universe and more about to occur in the universe. These are positions of high authority in this community that basically initiated this illegal voyeur camera activity for all these people viewing in, for the free radicals to backfire and basically attack these people's immune system and give them cancer. Um, yeah, they're about to lose their jobs. Position of high, but position of high authorities knew about this, apparently. They knew about it or they initiated it or both. Um, but... It sounds like the people that already have cancer are about to find out they have cancer or family members of these people have already put in official reports against these position of high authorities or they're about to, which is going to create job losses for these people. Series of chain events, unfoldment, series of chain events. Um, but they should. They should because this is terrible. This is seriously terrible and nobody should do this. This is like an attack on an entire community. This is like an attack on the entire community. Um, and I'm serious. I'm sure it didn't benefit the poor family that was being abused and exploited. And I'm sure it didn't benefit these poor people that have already found out they have cancer or is about to find out they have cancer. It just padded these position of high authorities pocketbooks to use these people and this family. There is about to be huge chaos in this community. There's about to be huge chaos in this community. There's about to be huge chaos in this community. Yeah, it's not properly synergizing um, because you can't use energetic and spiritual laws and universal laws is you should not ever abuse and exploit anybody. So it created all these series of chain events, but now these people have already found out they have cancer or is about to find out they have cancer because of the free radicals and um, viewing in on and the laws of karma. They shouldn't have done what they did. But in all fairness, some of these people, I don't feel they even knew because they were lied to. They were lied to about what the real premise was. I feel it was a big scam, spam, and fraud. It was a huge ass scam. Huge. And one of these people was about to place a lawsuit <clears throat> on one of these people. For one, it's two, two and two plus of these people. Okay, it was a huge ass scam and fraud. That's confirmation from the spiritual universe. It was a huge ass scam and fraud. And one of these people, I think one of the cancer patients, um, I feel for some of you guys, you are cancer patients or you're about to become. I feel for some, some of you guys in this, if you resonate in this, you have just found out you have cancer. For some, you're about to find out you have cancer. And I'm serious. Um, this is serious. Uh, this is terrible. Uh, for some, you could know the family that was abused and exploited um, or not. But... Or you could be the position of high authority is about to get terminated over this. Or know somebody. Or know the position of high authority is about to get terminated over this. How that resonates and applies. But this is terrible. Um, I heard there's about to be huge chaos in the community. Huge. And um, they're about to regret they ever did it. Well, they shouldn't have never did it to begin with. They're about to get negative karma because things are not balancing out. They're not synergizing. They're not.
balancing the way they need to, but it's because none of this should have ever happened to begin with, um, is what I'm feeling. Because it created a huge imbalance in the universe. A huge imbalance. A huge imbalance. A huge imbalance. Yeah. People getting sick. People not being able to manifest. People um, being abused and exploited. People getting cancer. And we're not talking about one or two people getting cancer. A lot of people have already found out they have cancer. More, A lot more people are about to. There's about to be a lot, at least two lawsuits in here. I feel one of the cancer patients is about to place it on one of the physicians' eye authority. For one, for one, one of the cancer patients is about to place it on two or two plus of these physicians' eye authority that have abused their power. Um, and that's their karma because they shouldn't have never abused and exploited the family because it created imbalance in the universe, synergy reversed. This is truly terrible. <clears throat> Let me see if I hear anything else. These positions have authority getting terminated and these lawsuits are about to balance this out in a huge way. Many, 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 many people were wronged in this and lied to. Okay, I heard the positions of high authority and the lawsuits coming on these positions of high authority is about to balance this out in a huge way. Many, 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 many people were lied to. So, unfoldment series of chain of events, the lawsuit or lawsuits on these position of high authority or position of authorities, the job loss of these position of authority or position of authorities. Um, because many, basically, a shit ton of people were lied to. They were lied to in this. And it caused so bad, it caused a whole community, well, not a whole community, but many people in a community. Some have already found out they have cancer, more are about to. I mean, this is serious. This is, um, this is definite lawsuit energy. I mean, you know, you see on TV all the time, if you take blah, blah, blah medication and you develop blah, blah, blah condition, call blah, blah, blah law firm for a free consultation. Know your rights. Well, absolutely. Someone's getting a huge wake up call. Someone's getting a huge wake up call. I mean, I'm serious. I'm serious. And this sounds like this was an illegal business. I didn't hear it was, but it sounds like it was a legal business. And it sounds like this poor family didn't benefit jack shit off of it. It just pocketed um, this. Um, it benefited greedy people, basically. Positions of authority. Childhood innocence. And someone's innocence was taken away in this. A child's innocence. And this is about to become very, very, very public to many positions of authority, light side positions of authority, and many other people. And one and to a parent that does not know this yet, this is about to create huge action too. Okay, so <clears throat> this is about to um, a child's innocence was um, taken in this too. So I think that's the abuse and exploitation of this family. I think a child was ab abused. Um, I heard their innocence was taken. They were viewed nakedly. Viewed nakedly is what I heard. So their innocence was taken by being viewed nakedly um, by this illegal voyeur camera. They were viewed nakedly um, by people through this camera, basically. So that's how their innocence was taken. It wasn't like physical rape or um, or what have you, what have you. In one of these situations, it was molestation. In one of these situations, it was molestation. So one, it was molestation, and one, it was being viewed nakedly. So innocence, take, innocence taken either molestation-wise or being viewed nakedly through an illegal voyeur camera. But however that resonates, um, <clears throat> one of the parents does not has not gotten 3D confirmation this yet. They do not know but there's, um, or they might suspect it, but they, you know, you got to get verbal confirmation from Smite 3D to do something about it. So, 
I'm assuming the child hasn't spoke up yet about it. They might be ashamed about it. I'm sure they probably are. They're probably ashamed as hell and they don't want to say anything um, if they've been molested. Now, if they were viewed illegally void, uh, illegally voyeur, they don't know they were um, negatively. You know, they don't know they were. But if they were molested, they were probably so ashamed they don't want to speak up about it. But how that resonates, um, whether it's physical molestation or um, being nakedly viewed through an illegal foyer camera, light side positions of high authority are about to get involved with this. And I heard there there's a parent that does not know. They have not got confirmation of this in 3D yet. I heard they're about to be notified and it's about to create a series of chain of events. Hopefully on the molester or the um, or molesters or on the um, creepy voyeur people. Um, viewing people nakedly, kids nakedly, innocent taken away, whether it's molestation or viewing somebody through a illegal camera with their clothes off, a kid, a minor. Um, this is sick. This literally, my stomach is churning just thinking about this shit. And I'm serious. This is sick. I when I'll give you an example and then um you can click off. I'm done with the reading if you want to click off. But I'll give you a personal example. I'm a foster child, a child of the system, or I was. Okay. I'm a 39 year old grown woman now. But back in the day, I was a child of the system, foster child. But before I came to my uh my foster home, my foster home here in Alabama with my aunt and uncle, like blood aunt and uncle up here. I was in another foster home in Louisiana. Hopefully you can hear me. They're mowing the yard out there. Um, I was in another foster home in Louisiana. Okay. I got molested by the father in that foster home in Louisiana. He touched me inappropriately. He did. And I'm serious about that. And it was, you know, I mean, I got over it. I was real young. I was like four or five or something like that. I got over it. But my point is, sometimes that takes a lot to get over. And that's just the truth. Um, this, this shouldn't happen to anybody. And that's just the truth. But I heard the parent, one of the parents is about to find out soon, whether it's physical molestation or it's um, some kind of voyeur camera. Viewing children nakedly, illegally. Um Kudos, if you're the light side position of high authority that's about to reveal this information to the parent, kudos to you, sir, ma'am, because we need more of you guys in the universe like this. Mandatory reporter, uh, I feel you're a mandatory reporter, I didn't hear you were, but I feel you're a mandatory reporter energy, or you can just be a citizen about to report this and communicate it. However that resonates and applies, okay? <clears throat> but kudos to you. Um, from a person that was molested at a very, very, very young age, four to five, I was like four to five. I moved up here when I was six. Um, my hat's off to you, okay? All right, I love you guys. Namaste.